actually, um, <clears throat> in the book I just finished reading um, about the Ten Shin, um, Shinto Ryo Dojo in, in Japan, uh, they had some, um, first of all, it's a very interesting traditional school, like their, their teaching curriculum and style hasn't changed for like the past 700 years, which is amazing. <laughs> Um, but I thought that the two comments they made about martial arts philosophy um, that um, Do, the, the character at the end of, of Taekwondo and a lot of other martial arts, is to be understood as not just like a way of doing that art, but a way through life. Um, and then the, uh, the pun, uh, Heiho, meaning soldier's way, but apparently the Chinese characters also means the way of peace. So that was very enlightening, I thought. The book that Mr. Dillon left for me is, uh, I think, about the history of just martial arts in general or something. I didn't really, I just read the title really fast, so I'm not entirely sure, but that seems pretty interesting to me. So I'm going to have fun reading that one. <laughs> All right, well, stay tuned for more to come from <laughs> your local Hogsung Evil. <laughs> Random See, uh, comments. 101 from Mr. Warden. <laughs> He was talking about his book. Yeah, he just wanted to change it. <laughs> yeah. just, okay. just, you know, why not? Okay. <laughs> Bye. See you from Rochester.